those off? No. Those pillow marks say different. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. You got me. <laughs> anyway, want to broaden your artistic horizons? Loveless is playing here. And I got us tickets. <sighs> sure. After that, we could ride the Skywheel. Right. We missed out on that before. Yeah, but not this time. Let's go. Going down. See you again soon. Something tells me I'm going to have the worst nightmares when I go to bed. I'm getting this tingling up and down my spine. Ladies and gentlemen, something big is afoot. Where would you like to go, Kubo? And away we go! Our special showing of Loveless G edition will begin shortly. All ticket holders, please make your way to the theater. Are you here to see Loveless? We have recreated her stirring performance. Audience members will also be invited to participate. Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them Come on. Please speak to a member of the staff <laughs> at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me?
I've never seen her look more beautiful. Yeah. She's a real star. Today's performance takes audience participation to the next level. With our revolutionary technology, you will become the hero of the story. Only you can fell the Dragon King and win the princess's heart. Behold, a mechanical metropolis built of blood, sweat, and gears. The city of Guardia. An insatiable machine devoid of pity. Neighbors on all sides fell victim to its hunger while it grew larger and ever more powerful. The whirlwind of conquest swept up many, including him. Alfre was the traveler's name. In search of the goddess's blessing, he had journeyed forth alone. He flung himself into the fray in the hope of becoming a hero, only to be flung in jail and branded a villain. I must away. Release me! My blade thirsts for vengeance! Fear not, Alfred. I've come for you. Rosa, how did you find me? I sensed you were in trouble. T'was the will of the goddess, perhaps. Pray take not another step, gentle princess. Varvados. Oh ho! Would the cur defy his captor? I, by the grace of the goddess, as she has set me free, even now, so too shall she guide my blade. Pride goeth before the fall, and I, Garm, shall deliver you to hell. How shall your feet... May mine infernal fangs find their mark, and taste of your flesh! A splendid show! Never have I seen a swordsman dance with such grace and skill! The goddess must have seen fit to grant him a sliver of her strength. Perhaps his dreams of becoming a hero may yet be fulfilled. Now then, ha! Hail and well met, noble Alfred! 
Though I am but a humble fool, some talent in divination do I possess. Anything you wish to know, I shall gladly reveal. What is the future, if not the product of choices past? Each a fork in the road, none can divine the conclusion of every path. And yet, all tales that begin with a chance encounter share the same end. A tearful farewell. Well, that's enough of my blethering. It's time we set the stage in you. Tremble in fear before the mighty dragons roar! A truly remarkable display of swordsmanship, enough to prove his heroism once and for all. He had been unjustly imprisoned and stripped of his wings. Nevertheless, Alfred was resolved to press onward and reclaim the heavens. Now, without further ado... Friends, lend me your ears. Our aspiring hero's and indomitable princess's tale draws to a close. Only one act remains. Parting is, indeed, such sweet sorrow. But as they say, all good things must come to an end. Though it is our wish that this tale remain with you long after we are gone. So, my friends, will you join us in our conquest of despair? Spectacular! Though our tale be loveless named, we may yet restore hope to this heartbroken world. The Dragon King Varvados fears only true love, and so our hero Alfred will reveal to him its power. He will go to his beloved and proclaim their blessed bond with a kiss. Now, stand before your soulmate and let the world know your heart. My love. Alfred. Ah! Cease the charade! Love is not but an illusion! Ah! Goddess above, let my blade strike true!
bereft of wings and broken. I consign you to the Abyss. Thank you, Alfred, for saving our world and everyone in it. You are a true hero. <laughs> what awaits you at Journey's End, I wonder? Will the Goddess grant you her blessing? Or will the flames of vengeance consume you? All shall be revealed, O oh puppet of fate. So dance while you still have time. Dance till your frayed strings break, and you can dance no more. Alfred, look. Must you go? Those I hold dear are waiting. I don't understand. I cannot. But... Please be safe. Rest assured. I shall return. You needn't promise that you'll wait, for I know that I will find you here. You got this.
Go on. Wow, that was amazing. I can't wait to start bragging. I'm friends with a famous singer. Well, maybe next time you could take the stage. <laughs> Attention! The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. Well, the night's still young, right? What say we check it out? Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Loveless. If you'd like to continue the magic this evening, Ladies you're invited to use your tickets to the show for one free ride on the Sky Wheel. Enjoy a stunning view of the gold saucer and the dazzling night sky. Where would you like to go, Kubo? And away we go! We've arrived at your destination! Only may ride the Sky Wheel at this time. Grab your friend or partner and embark on a wondrous trip through so the sights and sounds of the gold saucer. Are Watch you ready to ride? Unfold before your very eyes, each moment. You ready for this? A gondola's here. Well, after you. You first. Uh, Cloud? <laughs> Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. Here goes. Wow. Nice save. <laughs> hey, over there. See that? <sighs> Being a jockey looks so fun. That's definitely not what the races are like. I guess I'll just have to see for myself. <sighs> it's beautiful.
So, have you talked to Aerith? Hmm? Hey, um, Aerith? I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zach. <gasps> How they were friends five years ago. What? Not yet. Right. Touchy subject, huh? She must still have feelings for Zack. I think it's a little more complicated than that. Hey, it's kind of weird us being here like this, isn't it? Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kinda. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids, even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. <sighs> Not one bit. We should probably head back to our rooms. Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> 